I, Christopher Mitchell, personally feel that gambling online is a freaking scam. I will never gamble online. And I, Christopher Mitchell, personally feel that gambling online is a freaking scam. I will never gamble online. And I don't encourage other people to do so either. Personal opinion is gambling online is nothing more than a scam. And I don't encourage anybody to do it. Personal opinion is gambling online is nothing more than a scam. And I don't encourage anybody to do it. Hey everyone, hope everyone had a great weekend. We're back again to educate you all on the scam operations of Christopher Mitchell. This time exposing his boyfriend, his gay lover, his wingman, his hype man, his partner in crimes, Brandon Winger. All right, as you can see here, and we're gonna play a clip of a video that's now been deleted from his uh, terminated channel. And uh, we'll watch it right here. Actually, uh in Crockford's Hotel inside of the Resorts World Casino. And um, I have my buddy Brandon with me. Actually, uh, in Crockford's Hotel inside of the Resorts World Casino. And um, I have my buddy Brandon with me. One time I wanted to come visit California and in the middle from the East Coast to the West, my car broke down and I didn't have any money. So I decided to hitchhike so I put my thumb up and after about 20 minutes, finally a truck driver came by and then he stopped. So I jumped in with him and said, hey, where are you going? I said, I'm going out to California. He said, that's where I'm going. Go ahead and jump in. So I jumped in and about an hour later, you know, we stopped and he got me a bite to eat. And he said, hey, I can take you all the way there, but in order to do so, you got to let me suck your dick. And I said, well, you know, okay, that's not bad because he picked me up in Texas. So that was just to let him suck my dick and he was going to take me all the way. So I thought that was a good deal. So we went back in the back of his truck and, you know, sucked my dick and swallowed every bit of it. And it was, it was a good blowjob. And Actually, uh, in Crockford's hotel inside of the Resorts World Casino. And um, I have my buddy Brandon with me. So again, that is Brandon Wingerger, Christopher Mitchell's boyfriend, his right-hand man, his wingman, his hype man, his recruiter for these scams and his uh, confidant all right and again as you can see here on this video of his first mastermind bullshit scam he's always there and his next mastermind scam and here you can see let's take note of this picture okay Brandon's doing a gay strip dance all right and in the picture, you can see here, Stacy's holding her uh, autistic child who can't even speak, three-year-old, and she's laughing. And then right next to her, her daughter, who, who she lost custody to, is appalled. All right, on the far right. All right, so again, that's the type, type of people you're dealing with, all right? Christopher Mitchell's boyfriend doing a gay strip tease or wanting to goof around right in front of Stacy, who's laughing in the picture in the middle. He's getting handed dollars and right to the far right with the arrow. That is Stacy's teenage daughter who Christopher Mitchell was watching porn at their house, got caught watching gay porn. All right, that's why she lost custody. All right, let's get back to the point. And his most recent one, and that's Brandon Wingerger again. Christopher Mitchell's boyfriend. So again, that's, if you see him in this fraudulent group, hyping him up, that's Christopher Mitchell's recruiter, hyping him up, telling all kinds of bullshit. He's in on the scams as well. All right. People need help. People need wingmans. People need hype mans. Chris, uh, people need recruiters. And Brandon Wingerger, Wingerger is his recruiter, okay? And as you can see here, his name's Brandon James Wingerger. We always have, we have his phone numbers. We have everything about him. All right. We have his address. And why do we have his address? All right. We're going to touch on two birds with one stone uh, at, with this. So first, it is to continue to educate the severity of what they're committing. Wire fraud, tax evasion, money laundering, and who's all involved. Okay. 
The reason why we get their addresses is uh, once con confirmation is uh, that they are involved, and Brandon has definitely been involved the last two years, over uh, two years, and uh, that is to implicate him on the FBI IC3 wire fraud reports, okay? So again, even though nothing's happened yet, this is to get them out of the low priority persons of interest and to, again, add to it. So there's a lot more involved. And we got people in there, once we get confirmation that other people are involved, then we're gonna do our back uh, behind the scenes, do back rate, uh, research on them and implicate them on these and just continue to continue to uh, uh, add to this case, all right? And number two, uh, second, the reason why I haven't been making as many videos is because again, this isn't to, not so much an entertaining channel anymore. This isn't to entertain those who love watching the double joke pots fucking just ramble and blah, 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 saying the same old shit, all right? We're here to educate those, make, try to make sure as many people doesn't get uh, 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 scammed, but more importantly, behind the scenes, it's what we've been doing behind the scenes, all right? We're not worried about making videos or whatever, postponing these videos. We're here to uh, make sure the FBI, the IRS, all these agencies to continue to pound them, pound them, get them involved, call the these casinos, call the securities, call the pit uh, floor managers, all right? Get them involved on who each and every one, the Choctaws, the Bossiers, all these casino managers, on who Christopher Mitchell is, what he's doing, how he's doing it, all right? Showing them, getting it in their hands, and just not be not just fucking idiotic security guards, third party idiot. Oh yeah, okay, we'll we'll keep an eye on them. Actually, floor and casino uh, managers that want to know who this guy is, want to know what how he they're he's using their casino as a platform to scam. All right. So again, as always, anybody that wants to help uh, report Christopher Mitchell's channel to get him taken down. We're trying to get this back into my buddy's hands. Uh, he has a fr uh, his friend, his dad, it works for the uh, governor, Rick, or yeah, Senator Rick Scott for Florida, okay? So once we, if we can do that, but if not, not a problem. All right, the link to showing uh, how to easily report his uh, cha gambling channel is in the description below. It's step by step. It literally takes two minutes to do it and you can report it each and every day just copy paste in the same report over and over again so it makes it literally 30 seconds a day. Once you do it and write your report, copy paste it, save it, and then you can report each and every day, all of you guys. And then we'll get that third uh, channel taken down. And then uh, you won't have any pass from here. All right, that said, stay tuned for the next video. We got a, a barrage of them coming out. Uh, the fake ads that he has been buying and uh, I forgot what else is on deck. But, oh, the challenge he's uh, that we issued him and he's uh, ignored the fake money, all that stuff. So uh, we got a barrage of uh, videos uh, coming out. All right. Hopefully this week and uh, we'll just put them out there one by one by one. All right. Have a great night.